Welcome everyone. We're going to learn about the body chart information item in this video. So to get started, you can go to collections and across to information. And now if you right click in the white space, you'll find new body chart as an option. And I'm just going to fill in some details here and you can set yours up as you like. And I'm going to have three options for sore, painful, and very painful. And they're represented by three different colors. And if I wanted to change those, I can just double click or I can add and remove new parameters. So let's save that. And now you'll notice that the information item is a little bit different than the text-based ones because it's a body chart. And now we can put this into our forms. So let's go to evaluations and across to forms here. And then we'll create a new one. We'll call this injury form. And now using the add button, I can find the information item body chart. And maybe I want to have a comment underneath the body chart as well. So let's add a, another question below, which just says describe your injury. So now we can prescribe that to an athlete and we can see how this looks on the mobile. So now we can see the body chart that is available on the form that we just created. So the athletes can just tap in the surrounding areas where they feel pain. And the more that they tap according to the parameters that we set up, it will change colors. And we can also do it from the back just by selecting in the top left there. So let's put it pain on the back as well. and we can describe the injury, and then our form's complete, and we can submit that. It's important to note that you can notify coaches once this form's been filled out, and if you want to notify more than one, you can right click on any of the items in your form, and once they're filled out, you can click notify when answered here and select from all of the coaches available in your network. If you right click again, it will tell you how many coaches are being notified, and then we can click on it again and change it. You also have the ability to send the answer to the XPS Health event log if you have XPS Health enabled for your club. Great, so let's have a look at monitoring and we're going to set up a widget that displays the body chart in our reports. So over here I've got injury report as a tab that I set up earlier. And if I click the three dots and then edit report, I can select create new just in the boxes here and then choose body chart which is the newest widget added at the bottom and then I can select from the body chart information items that I have set up in my network at the moment we just have this one and then if I wanted to also add some information I can select the injury description that we created earlier so now if I save and close this and I open up the widget, I should have the body chart just as we filled it out on the mobile and then also the athlete's comment. Great, so that's the body chart and how to set it up in XPS. Thanks for watching.